power outages in Hines County impacted WJTV's own transmitter facility in Raymond 2. Crews are still working on that as we speak. In the meantime, 12 News Tia McKenzie spoke with Raymond residents about some of the damage in their neighborhoods. Fallen trees, down power lines, and outages across the town of Raymond, just a result of Friday morning storms. The civil defense siren went off about 5.15 and woke us up. We got up and looked outside, heard lots of wind, and we could hear a lot of limbs hitting the top of the house. Uh, as yet, I've not been able to get on top of the house to see if there's any damage, but there's a lot of limbs around, especially in the backyard, down on the ground. So you guys are without power also? Oh, yeah. Yeah, the power went off about that same time, and Energy said they'd have it back on by 8.30, but it's past 8.30, so... <laughs> Not counting on that. My son lives around the corner. My son's mother-in-law lives around the other corner. So none of us had any bad damage to the house. I've just got some finger-sized limbs down in the front. But I'm very fortunate because I live right past this tree. <laughs> it's on the other side. Just when I heard this tree snap, made a big noise. And uh, it lasted about a minute. Yeah, I'd say maybe a minute. Seems longer than that. but. Uh, I knew it was a straight line wind because it didn't sound like a tornado, and uh, and then it was gone. You know? If you're traveling down Main Street, you may have to find an alternative route until crews can come and remove the tree limb. In Raymond, Tia McKenzie, 12 News.